Hello, welcome to another edition of Beer Dad's Beer Views and it's time for this week's 4 from 1 and this week's 4 from 1 comes from yeah, Leaks Brew Camp up in the Lake District in England up in Kendall I think they are anyway, we're going to open up this week's, yeah, they're in the Kendall this week's 4 from 1 with this and this is No Pav No Party and this is a 4.5% ABV beer Raspberry Peach and Passion Fruit Pavlova Sour I am best before on this one is the 25th of September, September, 25th of July 23, and it cost me £3.99 at Rattling Grill in Ambleside when I was up there a couple of, a couple of weeks ago. Um, on the back it says uh, there's no way we could celebrate our first birthday without a Pav or Pavlova if, you, uh, if, you're, if you're not a Kiwi because everyone, something, it's against it's against the law to have a party without one. It's, you can't it, you just can't get it. I am um, raspberry peach passion fruit to hit the, the the perfect perfect place between dessert and zingy zingy vibe and fruits. Okay, quite the quite the uh, label. It's very vibrant. It sits on the shelf really well. I am um, and stand so it stands out. I um, yeah, when I, when I went, I was up in Ambleside, um, end of September. So what we're looking at now, we've been to the end of October, so probably about a month. Anyway, if you're up that way, Rattling Grill, some nice beers in there, and there's a there's a, a beer shop. Um, I think it's called. It's it's, it's a, there's actually a, a, I don't know what it's called, but there's there's a there's a bottle shop in, in Ambleside as well. Got some really really good gear in. Anyway, proper tops what we've got on this one. I like the, the Lakes, uh, Lakes Brew Co beers. I've done a few. I've seen them in the decor range. Um, oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. I like the look of this. So, beer in a glass. I should give it to the old uh, car. As best we can. So, being last one we got, we've got ourselves a half a finger of. Well, that's blush, light rosé head to be itself. That is a, again, rosé coloured red beer, pink beer, whatever you think. There's a little bit of light coming through the bottom of the neck of the glass. When I hold it to the right, because the glass, obviously the light's coming this way. That looks really good. Let's get the nose so we can smell. That is fruity. And you do get raspberries, the raspberries is there, it's really good. Sometimes with raspberries in, in a beer, it gets it gets lost, but this is raspberry dominant for me. And I can get peach. That smells really nice. Let's go for the body in combination. Cheers. That's lovely. Now it's supposed to be a sour. And it's not. Well, it, for me, it's not a sour. I mean, if you watch this channel regularly, you'll know. Sours for me make my face go. Could be all that. <coughs> Excuse me, turn my face upside down, inside out. And this doesn't. This has got a really nice, light tartness to it. And it's nice. Um, the body's light, the carbonation is light. Um, it, it's 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 lovely. It has a really nice feel to it. Let's go for the big old taste. Cheers. That's delicious. That really is. As a sour goes, that is really delicious. It's fruity. It's juicy. You get raspberries right there. You get peaches and summer fruits, and you definitely get definitely get raspberry. I'm not picking up much of a passion fruit, but I'm definitely getting peaches, apricot, stone fruits, definitely peaches, and I'm getting raspberry. And um, it has got that cloying um, meringue feel to it. 
but that is a really nice, really nice beer. It's so it's refreshing. That's lovely. On a hot day, and I know we're talking, but we're now we're not into at the end of October, coming into, rattling into November, into the winter. Um, but on a hot day, that would be beautiful. Cold out the fridge, be absolutely delicious. It will slake your thirst. Mmm, that is really tasty. Now, this beer is not available on their website. It is out of stock, but it was going for four quid. So you may still be able to get this in, in various retailers that do Lakes Blue Co beers. Try Temple of Madness. <laughs> Excuse me, try Rainville. That's what I think. You may be able to get them in there. But anyway, I dropped this review up. This is Lakes Blue Co's No Path, No Party. A 4.5% raspberry peach and passion fruit of pavlova sour. Do I like it? Yes. Would I buy it again? Absolutely. Would I recommend it to friends? Without a doubt. It's tasty. It's not a sour. It's more of a tart beer, but it still ticks that box. It's a great summer, summer beer. If you've done yard work, if you've been cutting the grass, or you've done some weeding or whatever, getting your garden ready for winter, and you're thirsty, this will do the business for you. So, if you've had this beer, let me know what you think. Please put a little comment in the comments box below, the usual caper. Do that for the video. Do that if you don't subscribe down in that corner there. And I will see you on the next one. Stay alert, stay safe. Drink what makes you happy. Hey, Leo.